what is up everybody welcome back to a brand new video my name is Ibrahe and today we're going to be doing a match preview for Manchester City versus Liverpool now going to this game Manchester City we've been struggling for the past three games I guess or the past two games if you want to say it Everton they draw and they were kind of struggling as Burnmouth obviously we got the late winner goal from Raheem Sterling now Liverpool on the other hand is going to be Really, I guess, very confident as they won 4 0 against Arsenal on uh, last week. I mean, two weeks ago because of international break. So, in one. 4-0, uh, which was a very big disappointment for Arsenal. But we're not talking about Arsenal here. We're talking about Liverpool. They've put a very good performance with Mane, Salah, and uh, Firmino up front. And then there's a possibility of Coutinho, people are saying. Now, a lot of people are saying Coutinho, but nobody's really looked at their new signing. Alex Oxley Chamberlain, which is their second highest paid transfer in history of Liverpool. And nobody's really talking about Alex, you know. So, honestly, I don't think Alex will start. Uh, but most people are wondering if Coutinho will start. But uh, to be honest, I don't think Coutinho will start either. Now, as for Manchester City, Manchester City, uh, Vincent Company is out. Uh, I guess a little bit. He's got a manager injury. And then Raheem Sterling gets a red card last season. I mean, last game uh, for excessive celebration. So this is what my team is going to look like. We've got Guerrero Sané and Jesus on the right wing as Sterling is suspended. Then Kevin De Bruyne, David Silva, Fernandinho, Mendy, Walker, Otamendi, and Stones. As I said, company got a minor injury. So there's a possibility he might not even play. And if there, if he is available, then I would put company straight away instead of Stones or Otamendi. Probably Stones because he's pretty trash at the moment. And then you got Ederson in goal. Now, you're probably wondering, Jesus, he playing right wing? Well, yeah, I guess. Uh, because... Last, uh, like last season, the last few games, he was playing right wing, and um, you know, we did pretty well. Now, as for the prediction of the game, it's very short thing. I'm gonna give it a 2 1 for Manchester City. You know, it seems I support, I can't really say anything. Ha, I'm done. Like, they are gonna.